in order to retrieve the data for the mixture 2 propanol benzene I start the jump start here go to Dortmund data bank first have to identify the component add search component I use propanol and here's our 2 propanol and I add benzene I know the number is 31 but let's go through as you see it's very fast um, and we can choose benzene now we are interested in the binary mixture system exact match and we will find all the different data uh, for example here solid liquid and you see there is one data set not available so I switch this off these are the two available sets in the free version and I could mark them both and get a quick plot and what we can see here there is the melting point of uh, the second component which is benzene and the melting point of the propanol and there is a eutectic very close to the propanol so basically uh, we have benzene solubility in propanol and uh, here we have a logarithm of the propanol uh, of the benzene mole fraction uh, as function of 1 over t and at the last we would have the mole fraction of propanol uh, as function of temperature so in, um, I'm closing this now and let us regress it means here the pocket calculator fit we have several models here Wills, NRTL and Unifact are already chosen we can prepare storing the results in a parameter database for different calculations further on but we will not do that now uh, fit and plot and here are the results now and we see that we have different windows that which we could compare so this plot here using Uniquack it's a little bit low here a little bit high uh, NRTL looks slightly better in this range and there should be a third one um, which is then Wilson which looks pretty good here it has about the same problems here I would say and yeah also the other plots look nice uh, so we could now I remove the plots Uh, by the way, you could always um, zoom into the plot, but we can also have a look here at the objective function 0 0.15656 for Uniquack, 15656, NRTL is only 1348, and Wilson would be 13147, which here Wilson is clearly the best, but that differs depending on the system. Um, let us close the regression now and go to the prediction and here we use Unifac, mod Unifac and PSRK and we again predict and plot and here is the result now all three models are in the same plot and we can see here modified Unifac is much better it's a little bit lower here but then it's closer to the data here uh, generally all three predictive models don't capture this behavior precisely but uh, modified Unifac is clearly the best model here and naturally we can always zoom into some interesting region uh, and you see there's also some scatter in the data and we can have a look at the other plots where again mod Unifac generally gives us the best curve here is now the high temperature and this was the place where mod Unifac was especially good